hey guys what's up welcome back to my channel it's oracle bay 444 i'm god's favorite daughter and i'm back with another message okay make sure you guys like comment share subscribe on this video um if you would like to uh support this channel you can with the super sticker super thanks super chat you don't have to it's not required but it is truly appreciated okay so let's go ahead and get into this message it's hot out here so i don't know if this message is going to be long all right the channeled message is someone's always trying to bring up some old shit okay i'm hearing every time you try to move on and it's crazy because i just posted a video like this on my tiktok how somebody's trying to keep you a prisoner of your past you feel me <sighs> and it's like every time you progress or you try to shake your past someone always tries to Come in talking about what you used to do, how you used to be. Okay, and what about it? <laughs> what about it? Yeah, look, five of swords. One, one, one on the clock as I pull this card. This person is, is like an um, antagonist. They're always antagonizing you about your past or trying to bully you out of your future or some shit like that. Like I'm hearing you're becoming a better version of yourself and this motherfucker always wanna come around on some slick shit, on some sly shit. I'm hearing if you let them get away with it once, they'll slide, for, they'll try to slide forever, okay? I'm getting that song by her and YG. Tell me when we gon' slide, 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 okay? Yeah, that five of swords, of course that's coming out. I feel like this person ain't never on no new shit. So it's like this person does this to make them feel better about themselves. Yeah, Knight of Wands is here. This person is very predictable, to be honest. Well, actually, the Knight of Wands is unpredictable. But I'm getting what was unpredictable was what you did. You, you, you did something that no one expected you to do. And it took you somewhere you wasn't supposed to go, but in a good way. And so this person wasn't expecting that out of you. So now they're always quick to... This is the kind of person where maybe you go out and people are like, wow, you look really good. Like you just put on a new outfit or some shit like that. But this person gonna say, oh, they used to weigh like 400 pounds. Like, who, who who cares? I don't anymore. You feel what I'm saying? Like, I am not with Metro anymore. Like, period. I can't stand energy like this. And the crazy thing is, they think it's funny. Yeah, Knight of Cups. The Knight of Cups in reverse is about jealousy. So this person, I feel like they kind of envy you. Because it's in the upright. Like, it's, it's, they, they, like, they can't move forward. They're not on no forward movement shit. And you got two Knights back to back. The Knight of Cups and the Knight of Wands. You're always progressing. Yeah, Ten of Swords is here. So they're always trying to find a way to cause you pain. It's like they know that you came from pain or they know that you no longer resonate with whatever it is that they keep bringing up. It's like they're trying to trigger you on purpose. I'm, I'm also getting this could be somebody who... Like y'all was doing something together, but you got out of it and they didn't, they're still there, but it's because that's their own doing. That's their choice. Yeah. Knight of Pentacles. Like I said, they chose to stay there. The Knight of Pentacles is very slow moving. There's not much progression. There is, but it's not much. You feel me? If out of all the Knight of Wands and the Knight of Cup and all those Knights, this is the only one that don't really move like that. Okay? So I'm getting you moved on and this person is kind of in the standstill. Ooh. 
what else we got here for the collective yeah the magician so they try to mm, something about it's like this person is low-key doing magic on you to keep you in the past they don't want you to excel they don't it's like it's like this person may be a part of your past and so they feel like oh if you move on then then that's where i'ma stay is in the past or maybe you could have learned like a, a new talent or something like that okay or or something about your um yeah your talent or your resources I'm hearing you don't, you the type of person that you don't get stuck for long. You don't stay in the same spot for long. You do what you do and then you keep it moving. Because movement is growth. Something about your um, growth and expansion. Okay, yeah, two of swords. This person, yeah, this is why this person brings up it's like they're projecting with this two of swords they're projecting like oh yeah they may have done this but um i remember when the, what they used to do when they wasn't doing this or they you know what i'm saying they're bringing this up to keep you at a stalemate they want you to remember what you had to go through to get to where you are like you don't already know it's like they want to inform other people they want people to see you differently instead of in the light that you were in heavy on the light shining on me right now somebody wants to see you in a specific light they don't want people to see you as someone who's came a long way. Yeah, the hanged man. I'm really getting... Okay, we got Pisces here. That's the only sign that came out so far. Pisces, okay? And Libra. I'm really getting somebody's trying to hang something over your head with this hanged man energy. Like, oh, remember when you used to do this? Remember when you used to sleep around a lot? Or remember when you used to um talk like this? Or remember when... You know, like, who cares? What is it to you? It really bothers this person or these people. It could be multiple people, but it really bothers somebody that you got the audacity to move on. <laughs> Shit. Yeah, the moon is here. Cancer energy. It's like this person is emotional about your glow up or emotional about your progress. You make this person feel some kind of way. I'm sorry, but I don't know what that got to do with you. Yeah, three of wands, you done moved on. I'm hearing something about ascending. You've ascended. You're going places. Literally, that's what the three of wands is. It's waiting for your ships to come in so you can go. I don't know why, but I'm hearing that song by um lady gaga I, I think it's called paparazzi paparazzi i'm your biggest fan i'll follow you until you love me papa paparazzi so this person is low-key giving fan behavior 
like they track your your success they're tracking your progress like damn okay you a fan don't i know it yeah queen of cups is here scorpio energy Queen of Cups. It's like it, I'm really getting this person wants you to go back to your old ways with the Queen of Cups. I don't know why, because the Queen of Cups, that ain't got nothing to do with it. But for some reason, as I touch that card, that's the energy I'm getting. I'm getting that song by June. It's called Lost in Your Ways. I really feel like this person is just doing heavy projection, to be honest, okay? I'm hearing maybe you started a new project or something as well. Yeah, Page of Pentacles is here. It could be a Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, or North Node. It's like, because th the reason why this person is bringing up old shit is because they see the opportunities that are being presented to you with the Page of Pentacles. And this person wants to knock down possibilities for you. Okay. I'm also hearing Trojan. Okay, the Trojan War. I don't know if you guys know what the Trojan War is, but basically they built a, a horse, a Trojan horse for a war and they attacked them from the inside out. They got in through the horse, through the wooden horse and then attacked them. Yeah. So this is somebody who they don't watch you glow up, grow up, whatever the case may be. They watch you go from rags to riches with this page of pinnacles or something like that. And now they're trying to. Like, they want you to fumble your future opportunities. So they're bringing up what you've done in the past. So that way you could be stuck in this energy of like, damn. It's like the when you're in your past, you can't be in the future. You can't. You're, you're either in the past or you're in the future, period. So somebody wants you to keep thinking about what you, what you been did. I'm hearing been there, done that. I'm hearing, and a play is gonna play, 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 play. And a hate is gonna hate, 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 hate. So shake it off, shake it off. Or ooh, ooh, period. Just shake them off, shake this hater off or whatever. Because that's really what it's giving. Like, maybe this person fake supported you until you got so far. And then they were like, whoa, they're doing too much. I got to slow this down. I got to stop this because I see where they're headed. Baby, you can't. <laughs> okay yeah king of cups is here like i said they supported you that's what the king of cups is is support i'm hearing emotional support like i don't believe that they hmm could be a cancer heavy on cancer cancer's out here a lot i don't believe that they <sighs> thought you were gonna get somewhere or go or do something until you did it. Now they're bringing up your past. Because they want to create a problem. Or they want to create an illusion. Okay. I'm as busy than a motherfucker today. That's really what I'm getting here. Hi. Okay, we have the Six of Swords here. Yeah, like I said, this person has seen you come a long way. Okay, I'm hearing that song by Cassie, because we got a long way to go. 
Somebody thought you had a long way to go, but you got somewhere quicker than you were supposed to, or you did something faster than them. Because remember, I said that y'all could have been in some shit together. Maybe y'all started a project together, but you ended up finishing and they didn't, or something like that. I'm hearing finish line, okay? I'm also getting that store, that um, the store finish line, where you buy shoes or some shit like that, could be significant. Yeah, Queen of Pentacles. You busting out the seams with it. You could be a Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, North Node. A lot of people underestimated you is really what I'm getting. But I'm hearing you're a natural. Something is natural for you. Something was supposed to naturally occur for you. And <laughs> one, it's like once you got in your in this certain state of mind or in this certain area or this certain whatever this is person place or thing when, once you got to where you needed to go you took off okay i'm hearing take off period yeah the empress i can't make this up you could be a man or a woman none of that matters this energy you are the emperor or the empress you're right where you're supposed to be. You, 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 this is what, they can't accept this for you. They can't accept the fact that this is who you are. They can't accept it. They don't want that for you. They don't like it. Okay. It's like the forbidden fruit. I don't know why I'm hearing that. Okay. Cause the Empress reminds me of Eve, like from Adam and Eve. Okay. The Empress reminds me of Eve. I'm also getting something about the rapper Eve could be significant. Get your tambourine going, get yourself another one, get your tambourine going and get yourself another one. Okay, yeah. I'm hearing mind, body, and soul. Something about an upgrade. The Father, the Son, the Holy Ghost, I'm also getting that as well. Something about the number three is significant. Three, three, three. Okay, 33, 33, or increments of three is really what I'm getting. Yeah, the High Priestess is here. You weren't expected. I'm hearing, um, I'm hearing ETA, the estimated time of arrival. Like I said, you weren't supposed to get somewhere until a certain time or something like that you got there earlier than expected something was unexpected with the high priestess here though but that was none of their concern it was none of their business now they're trying to make it their business by putting other people in your business okay about by telling them about your past so they could try to affect your future uh-uh uh-uh Okay, it could be a Pisces or you could be the Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, North Node. Yeah, Three of Pentacles. They, yeah, this is them telling people like, hey, you know, um, this is what they used to do. This is how they used to do it. Okay, you in the past, baby. I'm going to need you to step your cookies up. Okay, I'm also hearing something about cookies, like the malware on your phone. Okay, something about cookies. Someone has made it their mission to degrade what you've done. They want to bring your accomplishments down another level because you're accomplishing too much. You're, you're getting too many accolades. You're, you're doing something well. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it well. Okay, period. Three of Pentacles. So, of course, they're going to bring up some old shit. Because when, when you was doing the old shit, nothing was going, you know, your way. I'm hearing that song by Usher. My way. Mm -hmm, my way. Okay. Something is going your way now. <laughs> That's wild, son. I'm hearing this is just the beginning. Yeah, five of wands. There, I, I feel like this person, they may even, um, 
how do you say this? Like when somebody puts stuff up against you, like they're trying to uh, compare. I'm hearing you cannot compete five of wands where you where you don't compare. Okay. And that's what this person is doing. It's like an invisible competition. They're comparing their results to yours. Or they're trying to tell people like, oh, they're not really doing much. Because look what Woopy Whoop is doing. Look how far they've came. Okay, everyone's journey is different. They want you to, to fight for your future. But I'm hearing there's something that you're supposed to get naturally. Like I've already expressed. Okay, you're supposed to get something naturally, easily, effortlessly. And as they see you getting that, because you're getting it in increments, they're trying to affect it in some way, shape, or form by bringing up your past. Because that's all they can do. Yeah, will of fortune. I can't make this up. You're they're, they're trying to affect your future by bringing up your past. And I'm going to leave it right there. That's the last card. But with the will of fortune, you're going to get it anyway. Because that's what destiny is. You cannot change destiny. It's already written in the stars. Okay? Like literally, the will is turning in your favor. And it's upsetting somebody. Because your past was the only place that they felt better than you possibly. I'm getting a little bit of Taurus energy here. That could be you or them. But someone is sick and somebody is fucking sick over what you're getting or what you what you've become. For some reason I'm hearing Dr. Joe Dispenza. Okay, he has a book called Supernatural Being or something like that or Supernatural Powers or something like that. You may have that book or you may need to check that book out. But something about you, yeah, you're 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 going far, fast. And I split the deck at the chariot. Cancer energy again. So if you have cancer highly aspected in your chart, or that could be this person. This is your karmic justice to receive this. They cannot stop this. That's why it's happening the way that it's happening, because it's meant for you. You can do what you like, sure, whatever. That's more karma for you. I'm doing me and you should be doing you, period. All right. Um, but I hope that resonated for you guys. If it did, let me know in the comment section. Um, go ahead and smash the like button, uh, share this, and I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye.